you talk about how hard that crowd was on the guys. You were the recipient, unfortunately, of the first ever You Fucked Up chant, which wasn't even a fuck up. You got hurt. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, Mick Foley oh. ra- later kind of railed against the fans on a, on a promo, mm-hmm. you know, knocking the fans about that. I, I don't think you've ever kind of talked about this publicly. What are your memories of, because you had the, you got you, you did the dive, your legs got caught in the top rope, you had the big goose egg because you hit your head, which scared the hell out of me that night. And I was scared even more when I saw it on TV. Um, but what are your memories of that night and the fans reacting that way? And were you ever offended by it? Because I want to use that to kind of open up a different conversation about the audience. Well, I wasn't offended. Angry, maybe, I guess. But here's the deal. Did, did the spot. I noticed he was a little bit too far. I hesitated, just as, uh, mentally hesitated. My, my knee pad clipped it, stopped me short, hit it. From that point, I remember nothing when I hit. I remember, I don't remember the whole thing, so I was on autopilot. Which is amazing because you finished up. You went to the top the rope top and hit the elbow off the top to finish the match. After I saw it on video, yes, that's what happened. I don't remember none of that. I was really knocked out on my feet. Um, but... It's funny because I did not go to the hospital right away. Really? Did not go to the hospital. Matter of fact, me and Gabe Sapolsky went out for cheese sticks that night. With the but I couldn't. But I could not find Gino's. But I said, you know, once, he, once I drove, I mean, drove around for South Philly yeah. for about maybe a half hour. Because like, Gino's isn't no, far. Gino's isn't is far from no, the not, arena. No, no. And no. he's like, you know, I think we need to go to the hospital. And I'm, dri- I'm driving. Not a clue. So we took. I had a concussion. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, that, that was not a good time. But, but uh, to answer your question, um, I was not offended. It was just one of those things that happens, and you take risk. Risk happen. The whole thing we 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 sell we selling our fantasy. Therefore, the, but the fans don't really take it as like you know you screwed. Anything is part of the gimmick, even though it, it you know it was real. And so I didn't. I ain't, you know, I didn't get angry. What I did get angry about was you never let me forget it. <laughs> like, come on, you know, let me. No, I'm, I'm better than this. It's just something that happened. 